of making new things of meaning and beauty, that they will be motivated, knowing at Tesoros, we support their efforts to create vivid new crafts that enrich our definition of being Filipino and be vindicated as these become appreciated and welcomed as new touchstones in the landscape of our cultural heritage. Although Mommy's many achievements are well known, many are unaware of how hard she worked at, for the development of the Philippine handicraft industry and the welfare of its participants. She was always supportive of the artisans whose industry have sustained our traditional crafts and welcomed new designers who passed her keen eye. They have helped put the Philippines in the global marketplace. She emphatically regarded them as fellow strivers who deserve to be mentored and encouraged, to be treated fairly and responsibly, as they, like she did, sought to make an honorable living. Because of our mother's influence, we, the Tesoro children, have made this cause our own. Especially now that the sustainability and survival of local handicrafts face enormous pressures from competitors for whom profit is the ultimate value, thus subordinating relationships, diluting the integrity of made in the Philippines as a mark of origin to the bottom line. Indeed for us, the Filipino designer and the Filipino craftsman must be nurtured. Tonight, we express our passion to carry on her legacy. Because of her example, Tesoros will always champion Filipino design by curating and showcasing the best of our heritage artisanal crafts and innovations that celebrate our values, the bountiful wealth of our land, our genius as a people. We hope the conversations we initiate on our national identity, the stories of sustaining our indigenous art forms while we remake, recreate these for today, will captivate the younger generation of Filipinos to join us. Their works will find a home in Tesoros. All around you tonight is the Tesoro Handicraft Collection, built through 70 years a concrete demonstration of how we have evolved and will continue to do so with the times while remaining true to our roots. Through this book, we also hope to preserve and pass on the fervor that fueled Salute Tesoro and continues to animate Tesoros today. We have prepared a show that takes us down memory lane a glimpse of the challenging times that shaped Salute to Sorrow and steered her passion for Philippine handicraft. We are fortunate to have master storyteller, performance artist, and fellow Filipino advocate, Mr. Carlos Saldran, who will share his talents for an enjoyable experience for all of you. Also, please allow me to recognize and thank the many men and women who helped make Tesoros what it is today our family of employees, both retired and current, our suppliers, our creative partners, our team. They share our beliefs and help keep alive mommy's quintessential hospitality of putting the Filipino first that has distinguished the Soros brand through the years. In conclusion, on behalf of my brothers and sisters, we convey our gratitude to all of you, our clients and guests, for so generous, generously supporting Mommy's ventures from its beginnings and making Tesoros a part of your own family tradition till today. Thank you for your confidence and trust in Tesoros. Ladies and gentlemen, I welcome you again to our celebration tonight and hope you enjoy the show. Thank you.